Oh, here in Media, Pennsylvania, walking Wesley. I have a brand new video for you today. Hope you like it. But first, I'd like to thank all of this month's Patreon supporters for supporting my efforts. And if you like to support my efforts, click on the link in the comments below. everyone and welcome to today's episode all right we're looking at backward inside edges let's watch okay so what you want to do is you want to bring your edge around and then you want to step onto a strong inside edge again bring it around and then you're going to step again on a strong inside edge all right now i'm going to go into details here this is me stepping out all right now i'm coming around again now let's look at my position from the side notice i maintain my axis my shoulder, hip, and heel axis, in this case, runs through my blade this way. Now, you have to have this lean if you want to be able to carve out your edges like that. At a lower level, you're going to be straight up over your skate, and I'm going to show you that after we get through these videos. I'm going to show you at the end of the video. Now, let's continue. Bring it around. Step and rotate. Now, this rotation, I have my back to the circle I'm on. This is going to help me come around. But at the same time, I don't want to over-rotate too much, or it'll make me do a three-turn. Again, press it out. You want to maintain soft knee and ankle action as you do this. You don't want to try to force your edges. Now, keep in mind, this is a rather difficult exercise, doing it like this. So if this is too difficult, I'm going to show you exercises you can do to work on your backward inside edges. Try to maintain your speed and flow as you do this, and you don't want to bring your edge around too tight, because if you go super tight, what's going to happen is, then you're going to slow yourself down. You still want to maintain your flow down the ice. You want to work on your edges every day that you skate, because this is a fundamental part of your skating. I mean, there are exercises you do that will carry over, that will have an effect on your overall skating, but at the same time, this is so basic that just by working on it, you're improving a lot of things. So. Don't leave working on your edges. Make sure you go over them at least once or twice each day that you practice. And now we're gonna look at a more basic version of this exercise. This is from episode three, Basic Consecutive Edges. All right, so when I push here, first I keep myself to the back of the circle I'm on and I stretch my foot back here. Now watch what I do next. I bring in and then I switch. So then I rotate my body this way and I bring my leg through. This helps me get around. This exercise is great for those still learning their backward inside edges. Again, push here. Again, notice the rotation. Got my back to the circle I'm on. And my foot is tracking along the circle that I'm skating on. And then I bring everything in and then I switch. Now, my body is now facing the circle I'm on. And my leg is also on the circle I'm on. Now, you want to pull this hip back because if you don't, and also you want to put the free toe back as well because if you don't if it's too far in the circle then you're just gonna fall in and you don't want that of course another thing you want to do is you want to pinch the side right here to help tighten yourself up and then you can stretch this side here and that evens you out because you don't want to drop your shoulder you want to keep yourself standing straight up like a T 
Avoid looking down at the ice as well, because remember, the ice isn't going anywhere, and if you keep looking down, it's going to affect your posture and position. As you do your edges, one thing you want to do is you want to press out your heels. Here I'm carving out the heels as I bring it around. I'm carving it around. Look at that lean right there. I'm really pressing into my heel to get it around like that. If I stay on the front part of my skate, then I'm just going to get stuck. I'm not going to be able to skate on deep edges and bring it around sufficiently. Same thing, carving it around. As you do this, try not to break in your upper body. So you don't want to break at your waist right here. You want to maintain this axis. Now to get out of it, you can either hold the edge and step out, or you can complete a full circle, or you can back push and then step out by crossing in front. Any number of exits is fine. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and you learned something new today. If you want to support my efforts, you can do so via Patreon or GoFundMe in the links below. Or you can help grow my channel in other ways, for instance by liking the videos and by sharing them. Alright, well, see you next time!